Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So after a week off last week, where we received no security updates for Google Chrome and the other Chromium-based web browsers, Google has rolled out for this week our weekly security updates, which were made available late yesterday in my part of the world on the 3rd of December. Now, as always, to double check, we have these weekly security updates. We head to our main menu, Help About Google Chrome. And the version of build will be upgraded to 131.0.6778.108 or 109, either or running Windows, Mac or Linux means you're up to date on version 131. So that's the latest version of build after the update has been applied. Now for this week, we get four security fixes. And they the security fixes are addressing four high severity security flaws and high severity is ranked just below critical and the good news is once again we don't have any critical vulnerabilities or any exploits that have been exploited and um, zero days that have been exploited in the wild which is always good news and the four high severity vulnerabilities that have been patched are all type confusion in v8 and that's the v8 javascript engine and that's a common exploit, as you may well know, in these Chromium-based web browsers. Now, just a quick overview as to what type confusion vulnerabilities are all about. Basically, they happen when a program attempts to access a resource with an, with an incompatible type. And then what happens, it can have serious impacts as it allows threat actors to perform out-of-bounds memory access and cause a crash and execute arbitrary code. So that's more or less what a type confusion vulnerability is all about, in case you are unaware. And I have had a quick look around the browser after this latest point release security update has been applied. And I'm not noticing any new tweaks or adjustments that have rolled out with this latest point release. So four security fixes, all addressing four high severity type confusion in V8 security vulnerabilities. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.